Hello? Uh, shit. Let's see, let's see, let's see. So... Hmm. I'm curious if the compressor is working properly. Because I have this noise cancellation stuff going on, but also I added a compressor. Just to kind of not overload the things. Yeah. Let's go. Let's go, fam. Let's go. Let's go, brev. One with my plan. Okay, let's see. Musk Reef. Elon Musk Reef. Reef. <laughs> but, but, okay, let's go. I wish he used those cards in combat, actually. It's pretty cool. Oh, damn, like, those cards are pretty cool. So I wish he used them in combat. Pointless, I feel the the hurricane thing. Wow, that okay, never mind. <laughs> oh no! I thought he's gonna like go into this position. After that strike. Nope. A touch of frost. Submit for judgment. a waste. That was a big waste. Ah, shit. This needs to be hit. 
with I think elemental stuff. Oops. Like it has to be elemental, maybe. I'm not sure though. Lightning prism, cool. Man, this game looks amazing, doesn't it? Holy shit. Holy shit. Okay, so. Let's see. So, this here place, that's the waypoint on the mountain, on the dragon spine. Which I can't actually access right now because it's, like, covered in ice and stuff. That I need to melt with like some special ability or whatever and i don't have that i don't have that ability yet i'm not gonna bother with it for now but at one point i will hmm. i should really tackle this ocean in here shouldn't i kind of curious how even i'm supposed to to kill it uh, so what else is there a nemo hypostasis okay so Hmm. How much XP do I need until the rank? I, I really want to rank up because I want to level up my heroes. Well, I need quite a bit, actually. I need quite a bit of it. Perhaps I should do the quest. I thought I had the freaking thing activated here, but apparently I don't. Well, that's a piss. Eh? I don't actually... How is that? What is this? Somewhere here. Oh, there you go, I see it. Cool. Shit, look at that. Okay, so this thing actually. <laughs> so this thing. I'm curious what's that one about. A floating city there or whatever. What? Oh my god, it's actually survived. What the hell? Oh my freaking god. Okay, I'll wait until the timer expires. Ah. One 
with my plan. From whence you came. There we go. I actually need I need some meat actually for the quest. I need to cook some meat and I need raw meat for that. Hmm. I wanna hunt something, but uh, if I don't find anything then uh, I'll just go to Mondstadt and buy the meat there, but I would prefer to hunt something. Didn't actually drop the ore, drop any ore that ore deposit that big one. one with my I just, I just destroyed. A touch of frost. Actually, so th th there's a there's a teleport point. Huh? I missed that, and there's huh? also this thing, this here uh, place, whatever it's called. I'm not sure. Huh? So I'll activate the teleport point at one point, but I'll uh, go here first. Oh, no, mine. <laughs> I thought I had one of those keys. I do hope they add some forests in the future. There should be a region with forests, like actual forests and not like small patches of trees or whatever. That'll be nice. I'll race you there. That's cheating. <laughs> Let it rain.
best you can. <laughs> it just froze. <laughs> just landed and froze. I think two raw meat pieces Attack is exactly how much how much I needed. Spirit blade! Attack! One with my blade! Okay. Let's see. So I need to basically like cook that meat and present it as an offering to one of the gods. Uh, let's see, I actually can probably cook it elsewhere, well obviously I can cook it elsewhere, but I think there was a good pot nearby, possibly, I don't know actually. I don't know if it's nearby anymore, I think it isn't. Hmm. I do wonder if it even matters which elements you choose. Like, there are recommendations, but like, I wonder if the game gives a shit. You know. Ah, okay. Okay, so what I need to cook is uh, more meat, I think. Yeah, pretty sure it's more meat. Forgot to set the character for the bonus. Whatever. <sighs> oh shit, I'm burning. <laughs> okay then. <laughs> <laughs> Oof. <laughs> Look at that. Oof. God damn it. Swift and merciful. They cool down a bit. Nah, that doesn't work. All right then. So there's some battle pass stuff. Man, not like a battle pass, am I right? On top of all the shitty monetization that's in this game already. Come on. Cook three dishes. Forge three items. Okay, let's force three items, shall we? Might as well. Can I help you? Right, so I already have a bunch of stuff here. I wonder if that actually counts towards the, the thing. Like, do I need to receive items or start forging them? That's the question. Oh, it seems to have counted toward it. Cool. Yeah, I've got a bunch of nice uh, upgrade materials. Uh, 
Oh, sorry. Okay. Uh, wow, I have 347,000 gold. Isn't that just great? Boom. Recommendation is Wind blade. Mistake. Oh, it got them. <laughs> Actually, will it be swift and merciful? So, so okay, it does get put off by ice. Can I light it again? Yeah. can't pet the dog in this, by the way. Zero out of ten, bro. And there's also a dog walking into the chair. Oh. Okay, then. <laughs> Another meaningless day. Not the first time this happens, not the last. Mm. Alright, let's see. God damn it, it really, it really is a bit of a pickle because I thought that this point was activated, but it wasn't. So now I have to like, go somewhere here and then reach this place somehow and then you know, activated. God damn it. Just kind of... Forgot, I suppose, that it wasn't activated. Stone of Remembers. Remembrance. And what would that be? Is it... So it's somewhere here. Oh, look at that. There's like a weird thing here, as you can see. Weird glowy thing. Okay.
the gliding champion of Mondstadt. Right, so I need something else here, I think. Whoa. What are those things? The hell? Fourth, my plane. Huh. Damn it. Kill the bird there by accident, I think. I'm almost there. Nice. Just gotta climb up this uh, sheer mountain. Expect him to get tossed off the cliff. Thank you. 
Have mercy, almighty oh Adeptus. I beg you, show mercy upon me and my brother. Spare our lives. Who are you? What's going on? We asked you first. Oh. You enjoy safe passage in Joyun Karst. It can only mean one thing. You must be Adepti messengers. Sent here to rescue me and my brother. What is he talking about? Oh, have mercy, mighty messengers of the illuminated Adepti. I beg you to save us. My brother and I, we only came here because our family is poor, and we heard tell of treasures hidden in the amber of Mount Hulao. It was stupid of us, but all we wanted to do was to find enough treasure to sell and support our family. We followed the path up the mountain, but suddenly, the amber it swallowed up my brother Li Dang. I ran away and made it this far before it dawned on me. We were trespassers in the abode of the Adepti, and this was our punishment. I had no idea how to rescue my brother, so I just started praying for the Adepti to have mercy, right here on the spot. And now, that long last, two messengers come to my aid. What? We're not Adepti messengers. We just want to find the Adepti like everyone else. No, 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 you, you must be messengers. You have to be. I have no idea which Amber trapped him. Please, you have to rescue him. I beg you, show me some Adepti mercy. <laughs> thank you, thank you. Oh, mighty messengers of the illuminated Adepti. I promise that we will never be so foolish again. Paimo was gonna ask him about where to find the Adeptus, but he seems pretty one track mind about rescuing his brother right now. So he said that Li Deng got trapped in amber somewhere on Mount Fuau, and that they were following the path the whole way. So let's follow the path down from here and make sure to be on the lookout for Amber on the way. Mm. Ooh, are you taking me out? <laughs> that didn't quite work. Fourth, my play. Can I say Twin blade. It is nice. Oh, 
Hmm. What's up with those big rocks that don't give any ore? That's peculiar. Oh, oh, I see. So those are okay. I didn't notice they were like. You were giving me the the things. Yeah, those things, those floating things. Yeah. Cool. Oh, there's another one. Another two Oculus. up a little. <laughs>
Oh, of course, there's a bloody weekly XP limit. Man, this game, I huh? swear, there's limits on everything. That's kind of the point, I guess. But Jesus. I mean, so it's, it's a point. Huh? It's the point, but it's a bad one. So, yeah. Yeah, we'll do that. Oh, shit. Like, I get why they place limits on everything, but it's still shitty, and it's part of the even shittier problem of, like, artificial restrictions and stuff. No, the business model, basically. It's part of that. Right. They just can't just not do that, I guess. I mean, they can, obviously, but it's, it's a, like, a rhetorical statement or whatever. Obviously, they can't, but they're not going to because it makes them money. Yeah. A lot of it, too. Huh. I mean, they made like 800 million so far. I think 850 was it? Remember exactly. The exorcists. I shouldn't be jumping as much, actually. <laughs> I should be like slowly climbing up. That's the way. Yo, it's that far, the fuck? Huh? Oh, oh, derp. Okay. Huh. Well, okay. Well, this point is activated. Okay, so I was... I was correct. That was activated. I don't know what happened even. <laughs> Why I get confused a bit. Maybe because I'm dumb. Perhaps that's that's the answer, surely. I love that green hell. Okay, so this is the area where I need to make an offering. This this is the area, I think. <sighs> yeah, so this is... Uh... Here it is. Here it is. Recommended element pyro, huh? Ok, 
Okay, let's um, get Ember back into the party. At the ready. Okay, actually, give me a moment. I won't be able to make any modifications to the characters of the end. So rock. Nice. Okay, yeah, it's pretty cool, so let's all come on. One senses the presence of a sigil of permission. One knows not why you have come, though the sincerity of your offering is clear. Hence, you shall be granted an opportunity. Find your way through mine abode, and you shall receive an audience with the Adeptus whom you seek. No one escapes my sight! The fuck is he dead? Oh, right, he is. What's up, Derpy? Swift and merciful. How are you doing? Actually, toss them. Ah, there it goes. Ah, got them off the lock. Come on. Disappear. I'm doing well. I'm doing well too. Submit for judgment. These guys need to be tossed as well. <laughs> ah, okay. There it goes. Lots of vegetables, nice. Except one of them, I think, fell down in there. Got them. 
90 degrees that will be here well i don't think i need to rotate this one oh, no mind. it will be the next one that's rotated ah shit i i fucked up okay I like how similar is the music in dungeons here uh, compared to Breath of the Wild. Like, the music is eerily similar, you know? The motif of that music, of the music in dungeons. I know the game is inspired by Breath of the Wild, obviously, but that, that similarity in the music is particularly, uh, particularly striking. Shit, what was the next one? Uh, this? Uh, I think. Let's see if I'll go through that, that thing there. Where is it? Oh, there it is. Okay. <sighs> what? Wait a minute. There was like an invisible wall or something. <laughs> okay, then. Okay, so wait a minute. Okay, right. So it's this first, and then this, uh, and then the other one. Uh, that'll be this. I can't climb on things in this. That'll be... Ah, I'm not really sure. Okay. 
Ah, it's one of those. Okay. It's one of those, uh, freaking, what was it called? Well, whatever, you get the point, like the ones that are where you activate another and the others deactivate. Where you activate the, the pillar and others deactivate and you have to activate them in the right order. There's like a real life game for that, I think. Kind of like Simon says, but no, not that exactly. Kind of like Simon says for the previous challenge, that is. Uh, shit. I have no idea how to solve this. I'm just like randomly, randomly activating things. Actually, I, I never know how to solve this thing. By the way, is the balance of voice and game volume fine? I would like to know. It's, it seems fine uh, based on the vote I've seen before I checked out before. Just kind of examine it. Let me. I want to know what. Uh, I, I want to know. Uh, somebody else's opinion on that. On the balance. One is most impressed. The path that leads through this abode defies those of ordinary abilities. The one before you is the Adeptus Cloud Retainer. Now speak of the matter which brings you here. You surmise correctly. This place did one self-build, as did one design the mechanisms within. In fact, even Gui Zhang and Rex Lapis themselves found one's technological accomplishments to be worthy of commendation. This place is huge, and there are so many mechanisms! Do you really have this whole place to yourself? What's it even for? Did you build it as your private mechanism workshop or something? It's just like the stories say. The Adepti leave the human world, find somewhere to go be a hermit, and then they research and invent all these amazing things! One is simply not partial to the tedium of social interaction, and wish to find some peace and quiet. Find it one did. Shortly after which, you arrived bearing your sigil of permission. But enough. State the matter which brings you here at once. You have disturbed the tranquility of this place for long enough. Rex Lapis. Assassinated? How can this be? Such a... Heinous crime! Who would dare? A notion is so preposterous as to be unbelievable! One shall have to verify the truth of the matter independently. Perhaps one shall quash Liyue first, then convene with the other Adepti. Wait, what? Did you just say squash Liyue Harbor? Are you seriously gonna wipe out the whole city? Only a response of sufficient magnitude can negate the possibility of further incidents. It is as you say. 
We have protected Liyue Harbor under the leadership of Rex Lapis for 37 centuries. But in the face of this coup, by nefarious actors, exceptional measures must be taken. Yikes! Quick, you gotta think of something! She wants to squash Liyue flat! And it doesn't seem like she's bluffing! Exactly what Paima was gonna say. We made all that delicious food and gave every last bit of it to you. We were hoping you might help Liyue out, not wipe Liyue out. Or at least let's, you know, discuss it first. Can't hurt for you to get a second opinion. Contract? A cruel irony that you should appeal to the notion after the merciless murder of the God of Contracts himself. The people of Liyue seem quite content to dispense with their contracts. They are quite adept at taking that which is composed of black and white and turning it gray. Nevertheless, since you come here in the name of Contracts, Far be it from one to abandon one's own contractual obligations. Least of all when you come bearing a sigil of permission. Rex Lapis infused these sigils with adeptal power when he first cast them. That power once aided humans in battle. Most of the sigil's power has long since worn off. It is but a keepsake now. This keepsake cannot be taken as proof of your trustworthiness. One must investigate the claims that you make independently. This, no doubt, is Mooncarver's very reason for summoning us. Your audience with the Adeptus before you is now concluded. Leave at once, and... Oh. <laughs> okay then. <laughs> it seems that they kinda... Screwed it up a bit with the synchronization there. <laughs> Was it? I like how long that dungeon was. That's that's pretty good. Pretty good. A lot of the dungeons in this game are rather short. <laughs> so it's nice to see a long one for a change. Shattered a bunch of stuff here. But not all of it. Oh. Wind blade. 
Yeah. Fourth, my plane. Oof, God damn it. Oh man, I don't even uh, I don't even know where that amber could be anymore, to be honest. Because it's like I shattered a bunch already. Fourth, my play. West area reached. It's a rather big area. A touch of frost. <laughs> God, poor animal. Jeez. Just decked it with a sword. With a giant sword. A touch of frost. Oh, cool. <coughs> what? what happened? You, you rescued me. Oh, thank you. Oh, and have you seen my brother? His name is Li Ding. We were climbing the mountain together. I just hope he didn't get trapped in Amber too. Phew. So he's safe then? Oh, oh, thank you. I will head up to find my brother now. Here's hoping I don't run into any more Amber on the way. Talk to Li Ding and Li Dang. Such names they have. Truly amazing. Swift and merciful. I wonder if it's a reference to something. This game has a fair few references, and I wonder if this, if this is one of them. Thank you for rescuing my brother, oh mighty messengers of the illuminated Adepti. What? No. I mean, like everyone else, we've heard that there's an Adeptus living in Mount Hulao. The regular folks like us would never have the chance to meet them. No way. Unlike you guys, you're Adepti messengers, so it's a whole different story. Anyway... We have trespassed in the realm of the Adeptus for long enough. We should get going. Thank you, mighty Adepti messengers. Yes. Thank. Oh my god. Really? Boy, it'd be super helpful if we actually were Adepti messengers. 
Because it seems like this Adeptus has got a real temper problem. But it's not like we've done anything wrong, so... Oof. Who dares trespass on my mountain? Who? <laughs> what the fuck, man? Foolish mortal. Come forth and receive your punishment. What the fuck is up with the synchronization, bro? It's like... You know what this feels like? This feels like they... Uh... They translated from Chinese, right? Originally. And it's like in Chinese, those sentences will be much shorter. And they simply did not like prolong the scene or whatever to adapt it to English. So it just cuts off. Like, like what the fuck? <laughs> what the fuck? It's, it's, it's just weird. Man. And it's the main quest too. So it's like, bro, they could at least pay attention to that. You know? Come on. Cut him. Because I ain't pressing any buttons there to skip stuff. Don't tell that much. You intrude upon the sanctity of Mount Hulao. You destroy the amber of my mountain. And you free a thief whose freedom is not yours to give. The thieves' ignorance was an affront to the Adepti. But your actions are an abomination of the highest order. We can explain! A sigil of permission. One was unaware that such things still exist in the mortal realm. In the beginning, Rex Lapis cast them for the mortals with his own hand. Few were made then, and thousands of years on, fewer still remain. Speak. One shall listen to the matter which brings you here. Then one shall verify the truth thereof. You would be wise to speak the truth. For Liyue is not so far from here that one would be easily deceived. Rex Lapis... assassinated? At the right of dissension? What mortal in Liyue, nay, in all the world, would conspire to commit such foul treason? Or perhaps the more pertinent question is, what power in this world could aspire to achieve it? Rex Lapis charged the Adepti with the protection of Liyue, and we have always honored this duty. As the people have prospered, so have we gradually withdrawn into the mountains. Indeed, this was a gesture of goodwill towards humanity. But now, alas, Rex Lapis, gone. Traveler, of the matter you have relayed, one has become aware. One now knows why Moon Carver has sent for us. Once one has dealt with certain matters here that require my attention, one shall convene with the other Adepti. Hyman can! Adepti always have magical powers in storybooks. Seems it's true in real life, too. You know, like how grass is actually Adepti hair, and rivers are actually Adepti saliva. There must be something similar going on with the Amber. The Ambers are the Adepti shit, aren't they? Or maybe crystallized piss. Who knows? Could be that. Or, or tears, for that matter. Yes, <laughs> the tears also work. <laughs> Your nonsense knows no bounds. This amber is produced by a flower that one has planted here, called the Karst Crawler. The majority of the plant is hidden underground. When stepped on, it produces amber to trap the invader. After taking up residence here, one planted many karst crawlers to ensure that the tranquility of the mountain would remain undisturbed. Over the years, they have helped to prevent many disturbances. 
But in the process, they have also trapped many curious things. Oh, so the Amber is alive? Correct. Thus, one may not leave this place in its current state, for fear of the risk to innocent lives in one's absence. One will depart as soon as one has attended to this matter. One trusts that the manner of your departure will be swifter in nature. Hmm. And what will this be here? The abode? Chapter what? Mountain Chapel. Okay. Wait a minute, this can't be. Okay, so there's this thing called Celestia, and it's visible. It's supposed to be visible from various places, but is this actually it? Looks like it might be. It does look a bit uh, kind of tilted, I guess. So the Celestia is that uh, kind of a kind of a heavenly land where people ascend and become gods and it's actually visible from the ground which is pretty cool so I, I find it pretty nice it's like it's supposed to be this kind of a asc ascension place and yet you can still see it from the ground now what the hell is this is something I'm curious about okay let's Go back to Liwe Harbor. <laughs> you can't pet cats in this game, which sucks, man. Zero out of ten, bro. Can't pet dogs, can't pet cats, can't pet no one, bro. You can do this, though. <laughs> it, it, it lands on its feet anyway. It's, it's fine. Windblade. And then it's just chilling. So you can actually enter the bank. Oh. But you wonder what's what's in there. I mean, it's a bank, so I can guess. But I don't think you can. Oh, I don't think you can interact with things. Manager. Yeah. So it's like a Russian bank. So it's Ekaterina, it's Andrei, Mr. Chi. Well, that's not a Russian name, obviously. 
But yeah, this is related. This is like a bank that. Uh... Oh shit! Two hundred thousand. Wow. <laughs> I just robbed the bank. <laughs> well, not quite, perhaps, because the uh, chest was like so obviously like in plain sight and stuff. Anyway, um, so that bank is connect is it's it's like a bank of a different different uh, like nation in uh, in Liwe. So the bank is related to the nation of uh, was it Snezhnaya? It's called Snezhnaya here, but that's not the correct pronunciation. It's Snezhnaya with a uh, What was it? With the freaking... You get a point. It's like... Uh, yeah. It's a bit... The pronunciation is, is different. But yeah, this bank is basically uh, Snezhnaya's uh, kind of a... Link to Liwa. And it's also called Northland because Snezhna is a uh, icy land, snowy land. And Snezhna translates from Russian as snowy. You finally returned. How was your journey to Jueyun Karst? I see. It was a pretty fruitful journey, that one. Huh. Moon carver, mountain shaper, cloud retainer. Conqueror of Demons. Some of these names have never come up in the intel the Fatui gets hold of. As a returning gift, I too have information for you. Regarding the Archon's passing, the Liyue Chising's response really has given me food for thought. They've announced that, as the true killer has not yet been found, they are not allowing anyone to pay their respects to the Exuvia. They've even gone so far as to try and cut off information, but with the right of dissension and all, even the Chising isn't able to keep a lid on things. How, uh, how very much like China, although <laughs> cutting off information a lot. Oof. You know, realistic and all that. <laughs> realistic representation. Oof! What the fuck? I closed stream manager. By accident, give me one. Go on. How did that happen? All right, let's, uh, let's go. Let's continue. Exuvia? It's common knowledge in Liyue that Rex Lapis is also an Adeptus. The Geo Archon is also the god of contracts and is also known as the Exuvia, prime of the Adepti. The mighty and illuminated Adepti of today all signed contracts to protect Liyue way back then. Guess that explains why they're all so focused on Liyue's well-being. Naturally, they both have the responsibility and the aptitude for the job. If the ruling Qixing became unable to perform their duty properly, the Adepti have the right to take corrective action. The Geo Archon's spirit has risen, so why would the Qixing hide his vessel? Truly suspicious. Oh, right! He's the whole reason we came here! If the Liyue Chising has locked up Exuvia and won't let anyone near, then our quest to find the Seven is already over. Oh? You're trying to find the Seven? And just why might that be, pray tell? <laughs> nice answer. A knight that gets duped by the Fatui would really be no knight at all now, would they? But I can help you with that too, you know. Really? Give me some time. Time to find someone. Someone who can help you break through this stalemate. Huh. 
truly fascinating. The harder they try to silence the situation, the greater the chaos that erupts. If you want to be around to see it all come crashing down, best you stay alive until we next meet, yes? Very encouraging, that. So, yeah, stuff is gated behind the ranks. Uh, Lee cuisine is inedible. Got some nice materials for the roof here. I like it. I thought already I thought I had enough to wish. But apparently no. Probably not. Wang Sheng. Okay, so uh, some domain stuff here. This stuff that I Okay, let's go here. <gasps> Speaking of things that caused uh, resin, which is stamina in this game, this game also has two subscriptions. Imagine that. <laughs> so there's a battle pass and then there's uh, the blessing thing. Amazing, in it? <laughs> Not like two subscriptions on top of the already pretty predatory stuff. Not predatory. Well, it's predatory, yeah, but it's also just annoying. God damn. Didn't grab the lizard. The lizard. Oh, 
the show begin. Huh? Hi. Go for a touch of frost. Submit for judgment. Music is really good in this game. Holy shit. It's great. Nice. Actually, I can do one more hypostasis and uh, that'll be enough. Actually, let's go here and unlock that teleport waypoint there. Might as well. Just kill two birds with one stone, as they say. see the pools from here. The Luhua pool. What's that? Actually further than I expected. Whatever, I'll just ignore that thing. Oh no, oh no. Again. So what is this thing?
Wait, I'm going the wrong way though. Fuck. God damn it. What even, bro? What even? <laughs> I was looking at the freaking hypostasis, but that's not the one I wanted to do. God damn it, hit the eye, damn it. Fuck. There we go. There's a the thing here. That is floating.
Okay, let's go. Cool. Let's go to the city of Mondstadt, shall we? A uh, couple points not activated. And also some here as well. At uh, Guyun Stone Forest. Okay, let's see if I can ascend people. Let's try to do that. Add Astra Abyssos. Some resin. I don't think I can ascend anyone else. Yeah. Absolutely. Okay, what about my current characters? Mm -hmm. She had a jade fragment. Oh, so it's like a cyclic achievement or whatever. So it's like, it doesn't actually complete here, it just advances, basically. Alright, fair enough. 57 achievements. What's this as well? So, this marks the new quests. Okay, let's see if I can enhance any weapons or send them further. Okay. 
Nice. That should allow me to ascend. To ascend. Uh, what's his name? It's this guy. Or another Lazarite fragment or Lazarite, whatever. I guess I'll just craft those things. See if I can send more characters. In fact, I can. I think uh, this will be it for now. I might be back later today, we'll see. But for now I'll be... I'll be ending the stream. Thank you everyone who watched and uh, I'll catch you around later. Bye.